And welcome to Hogtown in northwest Arkansas as the Razorbacks try to get back into the win column after a disappointing loss to Ole Miss last weekend. They are back home taking on Colorado State that punched them in the mouth a year ago. But they turn to former Texas A&M quarterback Nick Starkle today who will run the show. Mike. Inside handoff, there's a seam and a big hole. Off to the races goes Kinsey. Nobody will catch him. 75 yards and the Rams are on the board. Like it was his, felt like he'd done everything to earn the job, but he says his road here, he's worked for it and feels good about getting it. First pass of the game is caught. Trailing Burks out of bounds. Right, they will the spot down him third down. So on first down and 10, they'll fake it to Boyd, going up top, coming near side, trying to hit Trey Knox. Touchdown, Arkansas. That was quick. 24 yards. <laughs> Wide receiver recruit making a name for himself. Yeah, we'll go with that last year. Bringing some pressure again. Pass is caught. Trey Knox, first down at the 35. They're trying to get him the football, but just hadn't been a whole lot of room to run. Got some room here in the midfield. He'll third pick down, up the about a yard and a half. Inside handoff. Whaley with a big gainer. Still on his feet. Breaking tackles. Falls out of bounds. Inside the 20. Right around the when they beat uh, Alabama <laughs> back in 2010. What a catch. Third down. Here's Starkle. Underneath, wide open. Pass is caught. That'll be Chase Harrell to the end zone. 14 yards out. Somebody missed an assignment. Arkansas will take the six. Developed a little strip throat. Slowed him down. We haven't seen a whole lot of Mr. O'Grady as of yet. Rakeem Boyd, huge hole up the middle. It's a foot race. Rakeem Boyd to the end zone. Touchdown, 59 yards. And Dave, I just talked about when you throw the football down the field, it forces you to play a too high look. And what a great job right there by number 66, Ty Clary, the center. Giving the hole, opening up, getting up to that second level. And this is what Chad Boyd wanted to see out of the team, boy. Ladies, break the tackle. Arkansas playing more coverage here in the last two series. They'll hand it off to McElroy. There's a big hole. Arkansas couldn't keep him in front of him. And that'll be a big run inside. Kinsey back in the game to the left of Colin Hill. The fake it to Kinsey. Slant over the middle. Caught. Touchdown. That goes to Warren Jackson, and just like that, the Rams march it down the field. He expects so much more out of you than people think. Here's Whaley. He has the edge. Another foot race down the sideline. This time he's run out of bounds. He are around the 35. He hit from 55 last year against Vanderbilt. Good clean snap for Limpert. Strong leg. Kick on the way. It is good. A no-doubter from Connor Limpert. Nine. That run was just dumb to Josh. Oh, loose football on the turf. I think that was Busta Brown coming up with the loose football. Arkansas five out of six on third downs today. Nice run from Chase Hayden, his first action Two. today. It is up and it's good. Chad Morris in this Arkansas offense with 27 points. Pressure comes. Hill hit and dropped back at the 16. This is the first time they get him out on the edge. He's forcing his defense to really cover every aspect of it. Ooh, loose football. It's on the turf and the Rams will have it. That'll give him outstanding field position as it looked like Starkle never got the ball in the belly of Rakeem Boyd.
clean pocket. Fires over the middle. Pass is caught by Jackson. He's down to the one yard line. Kick off so all bounce. Quarterback sneak by Hill. Does he have enough in that 6-5 frame to get in? No signal yet. There it is. Touchdown, Colorado State. Joe Brady came over from New Orleans Saints, and he's rejuvenated that LSU offense. Here's Kinsey. Makes a man miss. Hey, he said, Big gainer out of competition in pregame. He hit from over 50 in a false scrimmage. This one from 46. He's got it. And now you see he's starting to understand where everybody should be in this offense. Woods comes in motion across the formation, but Starkle will throw. Pass is just snatched right out of midair by Traylon Burks inside the five. They'll Two tight ends. Working left side, boy, touchdown, untouched. A huge hole off the left side, and Boyd picks up his second rushing touchdown of the day. Kenzie back in a tailback. Oh, and he is met behind the line. He'll lose a second and goal from about the eight and a half. O'Brien, his first series, steps up at the pocket and is hammered. He's from dropped at the 21 year hash mark. He will split the uprights. Only hope Make it's it not as serious as they thought it is. Trying to throw it back to Kinsey. Has a chance to catch it, but running right back into the teeth of that defense. This is third and third. This time. Four-man rush. Pocket collapses. O'Brien will throw on the run. Down the field. Caught by Wright. Does he stay in back? He does to the end zone. Touchdown, Colorado State, 75 yards. Boy, it looked like he stepped out of bounds. It's to that degree and not to the degree that keeps him out for a long time. O'Brien throws back shoulder, passes caught. Nice grab from Wolf. Well, he didn't even know he was making the trip till yesterday. They've had some kicking issues, and they brought him along. That kick is on the way, and it is no good. He missed it left, had the That's distance. Two and a half quarters. I think they have just really just done a good job of... For Colorado right State, he was definitely going to blitz there, and Stronger does a great job of getting the ball out of his hands. First time he's really seen some zip on a pass for him in a while. Comes across the middle. This one is picked up by Burks, and he's inside the 40. Art down to the 30. Getting the ball out and throwing it to Burks there. Oh, right in the belly of Trey Knox. It was on the right. Did not take a sack. Three tight end look. Arkansas runs it with Whaley to the end zone. Touchdown from five yards out, and the Hawks are back out in front. Lofts it up, has O'Grady, first down, inside the 40, he's still on his feet, down to the 30, are you kidding me, he's going to take it to the end zone, what a job by Cheyenne O'Grady, 62 yards, man. inside the box here that's not conducive for running the football you got one-on-one -on, -one on the outside press coverage all the way across the board and you find your tight end Cheyenne O'Grady versus a linebacker who does not want to be in space and all this is want to right here he's got five six Colorado State players around him trying to bring him down and the effort and attitude for him to get through all these different tackles here Dave you said it right oh my god Nobody could bring down Cheyenne O'Grady here. What a big play for Arkansas. Scooter Harris with another tackle. That's 11 for their middle linebacker. Loss of a yard. Second down. Let's call it 12. Pressure comes. O'Brien is sacked inside the 25. Gabe Richardson. 
Back at the 26-yard line. They got to get it out to the 47. They'll dump it off underneath to Kinsey, and he has fumbled the football. It is scooped up by Ladarius Bishop. Touchdown, Arkansas. You can call the Hogs now. The Hogs are definitely being called now. To Hayden Henry, the junior linebacker, the guy a lot of his teammates refer to as an animal. Watch this play. And then Bishop says, thank you very much. The scoop and score, and Arkansas has opened it up. O'Brien, they swing it out. Flag comes in from our back judge. So now they are backed all the way up. First and 25. O'Brien, they'll be even backed up further inside the 10. A loss of seven more. Boy, nothing there for McElroy. Arkansas pick up the win. They put 55 on the board.